Hey guys, I'm Lon here from Another Oasis. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, I'm really honored to be here to meet one of my friends that are really enthusiastic about Platys Room. So I met him during the creating Platys Room two years ago, and since then, we've become really good friends to talk about Platys Room. So I heard he's moved to a new place. You can see this one look marvelous. And uh, I got a chance to meet him and to get his permissions to have a tour around his house to see how he care about his plant and also how he create a space that's suitable for plants to grow indoor. Follow me. So I can see he really loved Astro Boy, you know, that's what I heard. And I know he got a vast collection of uh, Astro Boy in his house cabinet. And uh, this corner is really good. It looks like a mini jungle. Has a lot of aerods. I can see he grow mostly aerods in his garden. And uh, yeah, they're growing really fine and lush. Oh my god, look at all these platys room. Yeah, let's go. We're gonna meet Jimmy. I think I saw where he is. Hello! Hi! <laughs> Welcome! Jimmy's there. Hi, welcome to my home. So we are here now in Jimmy's house and uh, welcome Jimmy. Hi. Welcome. So you have a marvelous place and thank you so much for the coffee. I think you are really a coffee enthusiast also. And can you tell us more about how do we meet? How, how do we become friends already? Do you still remember? How do we meet? Uh? Yeah. I think a few years ago, you do uh, the Predicerium creating some show. Oh yes, uh, yeah, yes, the gallery yes. at the, yes. the Ambang there. Oh, Lai Lai Art Gallery. Is that gallery. the first time that we meet? Not yet, no. no One right. more time, I meet you before at the, your place. I bought a McDowell from you. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, Remember? I think I think during the time everyone is looking for yeah, yeah, Philodendron yeah, McDowell. MCO, right? uh, yes, tree. yes. MCO so, tree. Yeah, uh, during the MCO periods of time, everyone is looking for my Philodendron Dean McDowell. And I believe you, he's one of the buyers that get actually yes, got my yes. cutting. I didn't know about that. The plant and still still have now, yeah. Yeah. Growing yeah. back. Yeah. yeah, I think you can see the plants later. later. Yeah. And yeah, can you tell us? Tell us more about this place, Jimmy. Uh, when do you move here and why do you have the idea of creating a space like this? And what is this place? Uh, this is my house actually. It's a double story. I bought this before MCO, the first MCO. Okay. So after MCO, the, all the progress done. Then okay. I start renovate uh, almost uh, one year, almost okay. a year. Okay. Then I moved in since uh, last year, 2023, July. Mm. Until now, almost uh, eight months. Uh. Yeah. All right, all Before right. this, I already have some plan in my old, the previous uh, home. Okay. It's a, a old, old apartment. Okay, uh, okay. So I have a lot of plants there. Start from there, then I move here. So I add, add more, more and more collections. Yeah, more and more. But yeah. when you move here, right, you must be uh, thinking about how to create a space that is accommodate for the plants to grow well, right? Yeah, Do yeah, you have yeah. any idea before you move in here? Because I see this place have a really good amount of sunlight. Is yeah. it? Uh, you already pre-concept it so that you ask the architect to do something that can let the plants to go indoor. Yeah, because the architect is my cousin, so we have um, well communicated on this. Okay. okay. So actually, the plant got few types uh, maybe a philodendron, endorium, or uh, pedicerium, okay. or also the cortex. Some. Uh, yeah. Uh, so we plan uh, the open garden is uh, it's more suitable for the practice, uh, for the philodendron. Big foliage plant. Yeah, right? yeah, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. All right, all right. And I wish to have a pedicerium wall. Yeah. Yeah, that's why when you come in the entrance, the partial area there, yeah. we have the second, the two double the, volume yeah, on the yeah, wall. I saw that. Yeah, yeah. Really so high. the pedicelium can hang on the wall. Okay. Uh, it's more right. easy and look 
look nice. Uh. But here, this yeah. space also really good amount of sunlight, right? Yeah, is yeah, it, yeah, yeah. Is it because you purposely asked the architect to create a space that, that you can actually allow the natural sunlight the to sunlight. come in here during this period of time? Yeah, the sunlight uh, maybe can say save some energy at the during the noon, yeah, during the yeah, yeah. so no need to on the light or something. Okay. And the more natural light, then the place is uh, more cozy and wouldn't yeah, have the, the smell. Yeah. Being, I feel uh, really yeah. cozy here when I sit down here. Yeah. I can just hang up, uh, hang out here, and also drink some coffee. And uh, is it when you come here, does it already have an assisting of this um, this area so that the sunlight, or you already ask someone to knock it off with the sun rooftop yeah, so we, that we redo all the ceiling actually. So uh, that's me. We bought this place. We structure everything, we structure everything from scratch again. Yeah, from scratch. Oh, yeah. all right. Yeah. It's a really nice place. Yeah, so that's why it take time around one year yeah. for the construction. Yeah. Can you show us more about this place? Sure, sure, so, sure. you know, yeah. yeah. Wow, it's really bright here, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Afternoon now. Yeah. Yeah. So, like I said, you created this place, and it allows the natural sunlight to come in, and it create a really good atmosphere. The vibe is really good. And other than that, I think it's reasonable to grow this plant or something. Yeah, right? the indoor plant. So this is mm. a Chinese door plant, if yeah, I'm not yeah, mistaken. Yeah, yeah. I forgot about the botanical terms. And it's growing really fine. Those are the new shoots, you know? Yeah, the, the new shoot upstate. Uh, so, I, I have this already maybe around seven months. Uh, mm -hmm. Before I move in my body. Right, right. Already four tires. Already, oh, grow already yeah. grow four tires? Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow, okay. Quite fast. Uh. Yeah, yeah. I think it's a really hardy plant in general, mm. and it really wipes up the whole place. Then it looks really uh, cozy it's and also green. Yeah, yeah, it's with all life. this green foliage inside the house. You know, it, it creates a life. Mm. You know, we can feel it's really lively here. And how do you care about this? How do you care for this plant? Do you? I not much care actually. Okay. I just put water. All maybe right. uh, once a week. I you just water put, them. Uh, three liter. Three liter water on it. I see. How do you water them? I see there's actually a tray of roller. Yeah, I just put water like that. How about this one? The, the roller is easy for me to move. Also, oh, you move yeah. around the. Yeah, oh. yeah. Sometimes, because the dining table next okay. to it, I have a more friend come here and so move, move the table. Around. Yeah, move it around. Oh. So easy for me to move. Around. Smart. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you every day had to carry this huge one. No la. Exercise. <laughs> <laughs> it's like guest tongue also my. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like. yeah. It's just this for guest tongue one. I can tell yeah. this pot is really heavy. So with yeah, this yeah, thing yeah. is you know it's easy for you to move around. Yes. So this is your dining place, right? Yeah. So here will be your coffee tables, your kitchen. A dry kitchen or drinks bar or something. Right. Yeah. It's really nice. With all this place I can actually grow a lot of plants. And I can. see there's one collections of um some teapots or some Is it teapot? Uh, yeah, teapot. And ceramic. there's a really nice philodendron Florida beauty here. Yeah, the celebrity brand last time. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> These combinations, I'm telling you this, bro, it looks really good, you know? And uh, actually, I think it's really good for you to put some antique with plants, you know? It's really mm. best combinations. And also, of course, this the, one. Because uh, sometimes the antique will let you feel, uh, feel scared. Okay, because some people too, have too a really things, superstitious uh, yeah, 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 yeah. antique, right? So you, when you have some plant, it's a life. So you can matching the pairing, oh, so the webs yeah, can yeah, be yeah. more active. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Are you a feng shui, bro? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> is it feng shui? Just feel comfortable on it. Oh, yeah. so it means that some people are really superstitious about antique. Yeah. So they will actually create plants. Yes. It's a combination so that you won't feel so. Can balance, uh, maybe. Yeah. Oh, all right, yin mm. and yang. Yeah, it's some, like something. <laughs> can I know more about this? What's this? Is it a real peanut? You can try. Uh, which is a ceramic. Yeah. <laughs> so this is all decorations you yeah, like decoration, to collect. Yeah. This is a tea tea lover they put on the tea table. Okay. Uh, when they have an extra tea, they okay. will uh, put on the pour on this. So, so they the pour color. the extra tea on the yeah, 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 yeah. fake yes. pottery peanut. Yeah. So the color will be more natural. Yeah. It's oh. same goes to this. They are called a uh, cha chong. Uh. So it's a um, it's a uh, it's a decoration on the tea. I paper. see this a frog on top of a watermelon. Yeah, yeah. They, this got meaning behind. Ding the, gua gua. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> <laughs> the the oh. frog uh, standing on top of the watermelon. Watermelon. Yeah. Oh, so in Chinese it's called ding, ding gua, gua. gua Yes. Wow, it is a really good uh, good symbolic meanings. Behind, meanings yeah. Uh. So yeah. people use this as a tea pottery ceremony. So they yeah. pour extra tea here. Yeah, when pour extra tea, you have you can see the stand of the tea. Then the color will be more natural. Wow. Yeah. Right, good, good. Wow, <laughs> this is all the really nice collections that mm. you have, right? Okay, and I see you are actually also a collectors. 
Uh, Not only in plants. Yeah. I'll also, some you know. some things. <laughs> yeah. Show me. Show yes, us. Sure. Yeah. Bro, can I know more about this? Where yeah. you got this? This the uh, KFC uncle. Ah. Yeah. The where you got this? Ah. I think really? they no longer produce this one, right? It's become an antique right yes, now. Yes, yes, yes. It's a very special chance okay. I get from someone. Yeah. All right. Okay. I believe this is from the uh, giant Ebo that that the really old KFC yeah, yeah, building, yeah. right? It's the academy, like last time KFC academy. Okay. Yeah. I go there in the wheel for the part time before. Okay. Since uh, we are uh, the school time, the okay. holiday job. Okay. Okay. Yeah. They, they are academy to provide some planning. So there. how do you get this piece back home and become a really nice decorative element? And from the previous, the the uh, antique collector also. Yeah. So he already collected. Yes. Uh, and then you buy over from the collector. Yes, yes, yes. Oh. Mm. Can I know how much is it? Uh, not really. Uh, what's expensive, the What's the figure <laughs> like? Six figure, five figure. Uh, four figures. Four figure. Uh, four figure uh, for KFC. Okay la, The childhood memory. Childhood memory, man. Yeah. Don't you feel afraid when you walk upstairs and still see this at night? <laughs> yes, yes, yes. I, yeah. I, a lot of uh, friends come here to uh, get scared by him. Yeah. yeah. But after that, you you used to it, then you like a family here. Yeah, it's like a, yeah. you know, don't say that, bro. <laughs> like a family here. Oh my God. Okay yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. But it's really nice, you know. Yeah. I know you are actually collectors yourself. Uh. Yeah. And uh, at this corner, I see there's another thing that is really interesting. Uh. <laughs> so you grow mostly your collects plant here. Yeah, this uh, indoor cortex okay. or a succulent plant. Okay. Yeah, they don't need too much water. Okay. So I put here, then I can easy to control the water. So is it because uh, most of the sunlight is coming from this side? So yeah. that's why you are putting all the cortex. Yes. Yeah. Yes. The plant stay here around uh, two or three months already. Okay. The growing process is quite good. Okay. And, uh, I saw the, some new leaf also. Yeah. Yeah. It is mostly better. euphorbia. Uh, and Stefania also yes, here, right? Uh, this is Stefania Nova, uh, is it? One leaf, Yi Ye Kui, they call it. Uh, There's a lot of a lot, Kawasaki, a lot. Yeah, 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 yeah. but it's Stefania definitely. Yeah. It's really nice, can I hold it? Yeah, sure. Oh, it's really nice. So you are like combining, new, new shirt, combining yeah. your patteries with all these mm. beautiful plants, right? Very um, beautiful. This is uh, quite zen. Uh, yeah. zen yeah, yeah. yeah, this is good. Where you got this? this is, <laughs> I, call it, I get this from uh, the, the church when they do renovation. Yeah. They just put aside. It's a donation box, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. They, they, <laughs> it becomes within my table. They do one already, so I keep this home. Yeah. Yeah, you some of the furniture boy. I also keep from some uh, carpet or some oh, place. Wow. Yeah. Not to say carpet, just that people does not uh, know the value of it. No, I, I just to continue the second life. Yeah, yeah, it's good, it's Give good. Give them a new Look at the Japanese donations, kind of temple, you know. This is a church. Church? Uh, yeah, Feng Xian Xiang is from church. Uh. But it looks like a Japanese uh, the feeling, uh. feeling, right? Mm -hmm. I thought it's from Japanese the cabinet uh, color Buddhist or temple or somewhere else. Mm -hmm. Can I know more about the collections that you have here? I uh, have some Astro Boy collection. <laughs> Jimmy, I see you collect a lot, a lot of Astro Boy. Yes. So this is one of your collections, uh, also, right? Yeah, my collection oh is my here. Oh my god, how long have you been collecting this one? I uh, Around 20 years. 20 years? Yes. Okay. Uh, last time when I have a new car, the, the first car, okay. around uh, nine, 19 years old or 20 years old. Okay. So I wish to have uh, the toy put on the dashboard. Alright. Yeah. The, this time I, my previous boss, uh, he gave me the bed break. Yeah. But I don't want. I know yeah. the bread is, is more and Expensive, more collection. Yeah, more yeah, yeah, yeah. Sold after collectibles toys, right? Yeah. Oh, so okay. this one there, I see the Astro is quite cute. Okay. And and uh, we can't easy to get from here. Uh, we're not easy to get that. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So start from that time. So okay. until now, uh, most of the friends around me also know I like Astro Boy. They will yeah. let me know where to get. Okay. Or maybe they bring for me. For your uh, birthday. They help me to buy uh, something like that. Yeah. Oh my god, this so is slowly, really slowly a, like this. Uh. It's really amazing collections. Can I know more about which one is your first collections? Which one? My first collection? Your first uh, okay. uh, Astro Boy figurine. It's this one. Very yeah. small one. <laughs> is it this one? The one yeah, inside yeah, the, yeah, the dashboard? The dashboard yeah. From I, this? I think put on the dashboard around more than 10 years. Yeah, like this. Wow. The color a, a, a bit turned down already, yeah. mm. So from this thing, yeah, become um, this thing. This. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, it's cute. Everything starts from cute. small, ma. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same mm. goes to plants. Yes, so, right? yes. Same goes to plants too. So, and can I know how do you get them? And is it because you have a purpose when you travel to a certain place, 
you will look for a collectible extra boy figurine and body bag from that place. Yeah, also, but last time is uh, we walk around KL, the toy shop not many, ma. All right, the toy yeah, shop yeah. quite limited. Yes. So when you walk around, where we will heard some sound. Okay. Someone to calling you, come in, come in, come in. <laughs> it's a calling, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, come in, calling, yeah, come in, yeah. So I go in, they will see, suddenly they see the extra boy there, then oh, I will bring it home. You'll bring it home, uh, right. This uh, yeah, more than good, 15 years ago, it's yeah, like that. Yeah. But from now, uh, really easy to get it from Taobao yeah, or the shop. Uh, yeah, 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 you know? With the internet landscape, we can get whatever we want, right? Yes, Same goes yes. to plants, you know. Yes, when we yes. see something that we like on Instagram, yes. on any places, you just PM, you know. Where can I get <laughs> yes, this, you know? Yeah, they will just share you the link. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I see. And since that, that's your first one, can yes. I know which one is your favorite my collections favorite? among all of these? Okay. Favorite actually is this. My favorite is this. This is a tin toy. Oh. Yes, they still have the key. Okay. It's still movable. Oh my yeah. god! I don't think any toy manufacturers are doing this right Last now. Last time, and uh, now no more now. Yeah. yeah. And the quality did not same already. I think this is actually the toy mm. that is suitable for my father' childhood. Right? <laughs> hey. Maybe, maybe. Wow. I think these are seventy years. Something? Yeah. This one already 70 years. Yeah. And, 70 it still, years. and it still can be able to move. Can, can, can. Can you show us? Can, sure. So easy, yeah? <laughs> More like a grandfather now. Yeah, <laughs> really slow. Well, maybe the, the, the yeah. surface. Uh. Mm. True, true. So this is your favorite one? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, you can okay. hear the sound, you can feel the, the difference of the material yeah, yeah. and the the the, the, the toy, the head shape different. Such a good quality. Yeah. Yeah. This is the old one, you see the now, the new, you can see the face got some yeah, a bit different changing, you know, yeah. changing on this. Mm. Yeah. This is how a coll uh, fanatic collectors will know about all the details. Just like us, right? Sometimes we collect the, the plants. Plant, yeah. We will look Same. into the patel, the foliage, yes. and also how the way they grow and Tissi things culture, like that. Yeah, uh, tissue culture. Yeah, culture. All the spores. Original uh, corn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I understand that. Yeah. Mm. Thank you so much. Sure. Yeah. So, with all the collections that you have here, bro. Yeah. Astro Boy is really marvelous and amazing. I wanted to know more about your collections other than Astro Boy. Other than Astro Boy, I have like uh, plants, plants yes, yes. I, yeah. I heard you grow not only platyserum, um, you can mix uh, a lot of things. Okay. Mm. And uh, how long have you been starting growing plants? Since MCO trip. Oh. Alright, okay. Yeah, until can you show us your garden here? I see there's uh, a lot of plants outside sure, here. Sure. Yeah. Balcony. This a uh, this just a uh, uh, balcony area. It's the place I grow some cutting here. Okay. Yeah, but uh, and some new petisolium heaven on board. Heaven yet. mounted on yeah, the board, right? Yeah, yeah. So here will mostly place for you to chill, enjoy, mm, playful. Yeah, yeah. Uh, maybe see some sky stuff. Drink some tea. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So other than the balcony here, bro, I see you grow a lot of plants on the wall over there. Yeah, Is that the, the double tiers of the platyserum also for you to hang around? Yes, yes, yes. Oh, the okay. The platyserum wall there. Yeah. So that's a platyserum wall that you are growing. Yeah. And you you are hanging some aroids here also, right? Some. The the platyserum is quite big leaf. So when you look around, you quite nice at uh, the shape. Yeah, I can yeah. see. How do you water them? I just stand here. <laughs> Just wow. put the water. Just using the shotgun. <laughs> yeah, quite you know, lazy. <laughs> just uh, shooting the plants over I here. Also, I also install the water uh, moist mixing system. Uh, mixing system. Yeah. Oh, so you so will open cool, the mixing system? Can, yeah, yeah. Somehow cool down the plants. Open, cool down. Yeah. Okay, alright, alright. But I guess a platyserum are not really needed a lot of water sometimes, right? Yeah. So how frequent do you water them? Uh, three days or four days. And because this is quite open air. Yeah. yeah. How do you fertilize them when they are on the top, right? Um, when I hang out until now, around uh, six months already. So you already put some release yeah, fertilizer? Oh, yeah. okay, okay. The, the fertilizer will actually feed the plants gradually. Yeah. So, yeah. Do you have any special feeding for the plants on top of the there? I heard, I heard someone say put banana skin. Okay, do you but do that? I haven't tried that. Oh, all right. But I, I think banana skin sometimes is really good uh, potassium nutrients for plant uh -huh. But then also it, it got a bad side. It will actually attract a lot of ants or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I will worry yeah. that. Pro and cons, uh, I mean, yeah. And under this part, right, I see that you grow a lot of plants like I 
in the on the entrance. Yeah, the so, philodendron plants. Yeah, mostly. can we see that? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Okay. Jimmy, I want to know: Is this the place that you want to grow mostly foliage? Yes, plant? yes, yes. Like I said, this one is a really nice philodendron yeah. subinicism. Yeah. So Perfect. you grow it here. Yeah. And to create a jungle feel. Is this one what you want to achieve here? Yeah, I want. I want more and more. I want. Actually, I want this. Mozzarella. Growing up, uh, mozzarella going up. Also. That's why yeah. you have this uh, panel yeah. uh, here. Ready for them to climb up. Oh. Uh. So do you water them on the wall so that their every root will attach on it? Yes, I water oh. them. Even okay. I, I already cut this. The the, the root still going up. Yeah, I can see. That's the philodendron lime uh, You can see like a, like a ghost plant. Yeah, they. Oh my god. I cut already, but still. It alive attached to the wall yeah, itself. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god, this is the tenacious of growing pattern from philodendron. That's why they they basically grow really wild and create a really jungle vibes in mm. the house also. It's a really good choice for creating the, a large the garden. The plant here can reduce the noise or maybe reduce the dust okay. to, into my bedroom. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Also, inside here is your bedroom, yeah, right? It's my room here, yeah. Oh, okay. So you wanted to actually have a view from inside to yes, outside. Yes, every day morning, they open the window, you can see some plants in the window. Yeah, it's really nice. Do you any... How do you take care of the plants here? Do you water them just like this? Just like this. Any pest problem do you, that you have here? Um, so far, not much. You can see, uh, sometimes got a bit sunburn. Uh, oh, this normal. is a problem. Yeah. Uh. But I, I can tell that uh, aroid plants, I mean foliage plants, southern have uh, have a lot of pest problem, right? Mm. But how do you do the maintenance here? Do you use any pesticide to control the pest problem? I think the most important is the soil. Oh, yeah. If, if the soil is good and uh, no water. You mean the aerations? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, so can I know what kind of soy mix that you're using for your plants the, here? Uh, the aroid mix. Oh, okay. Uh, most right. of the aroid mix and the coconut. Coconut husk. Uh. So you mix it together? Yes. Alright. And um, fertilizer? Almost, or smoker also. Also the control release fertilizer. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I guess it's actually a way for for taking care of plants with a really minimal maintenance. Mm, yeah. So I am quite lazy. Plant, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean not to say lazy. Uh, it's actually a lifestyle. Work, yeah. yeah. So I know that your lifestyle is very busy. So when you go back from work, you want to have a really nice and easy maintained garden yes, here. Of course. Okay. Hmm. Yeah. And that's another part of a garden that you have inside there? Yeah, in the indoor. Can you show us around? Sure. Yeah. So this is your porch? Yes. Wow. Hmm. It's really nice. This angle I can see grow a lot of uh, philodendron also. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The leaf get getting bigger and bigger. Yeah. So this is something that you want to create to have a really nice big foliage plant. Yeah, to inspired come by you, ah. <laughs> <laughs> Always saw your YouTube. You, you have yeah, a yeah. high level and low yeah, level. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So creating a garden is really important. Usually we'll create a really high plant to create a canopy. Uh, and then yeah. we'll put some plant that is focused on the foliage so textures. Have, have the tree as a canopy here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I can see that you are doing something really well. Uh. Yeah, and also there's some filler plant in the bottom. Yeah. yeah. You're doing good. You Thank you. I, I think you are right now a master of landscape. <laughs> no, <right>? la. <laughs> still learning. Yeah, can you show? Yeah. Oh, is that a McDonald's that you Yeah, the, the one, yours one. Oh, uh, okay. Your baby. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's, no, nah, it's, it's already yours, but it's really nice. Yeah, and also uh, some Monstera Thai constellations. Yeah. So. And the special one, I think, is this one. This is a French penny. Oh, French penny, my Maya. Yeah. Uh. It's a very good French yeah, penny. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I didn't so, save uh, it. Does it flower? Not yet. I'm gonna see how it goes. Someone right? asked me to cut it. Okay. And let, let them do. Uh, so, how long you got this plant? I think around two years already. But I think this plant is really suitable to grow uh, from, here. From, from this side? Yeah. Until now. Yeah. Uh, I think Frenchy Penny is better to grow there on the ground. Yeah. So that they have more place to move around. You grow in the pots, right? Yeah. Yeah. But it's really nice. Look at the textures and colors. And I got this. At the street side. Oh, the, okay. The Pilong. It's a variegated <laughs> uh, allocation of Dora. Mm. Yeah. Okay. And what's those there? Which one? Yeah. Can we have a look? Is that the platinum panel? Yeah. Oh, okay. So, wow. <laughs> this is the old collections that you have. Yes. And uh, like I say, when you water, you water from the top. Yes. How about those that are at the bottom here? No. Um, same. Same. Water one. just shoot from the top here. And then let the water drip it down. Yes. I can see the platinum growing really well. Some is well, some is not so good. Okay. Yeah, yeah that's that's the experience that we get from growing different kinds of platinum, yeah, yeah. right? 
and the different pedestrian also have different the characteristics yeah, yeah, and also yeah. the needs is different so. yeah any special pedestrian that is your favorite here from here actually i like the philippine yeah that drop. is really uh, nice it's a it's curly that, one uh, yeah it but really now curly. i think the the front line not hot. enough yeah so they're not so cur curly oh, okay uh. okay and okay, the monkey knob yeah, it's really nice. nice. Uh. Monkey Knob actually is a hybrid of Veggie Eye with Blinky Eye. Oh. My experience tell me that Monkey Knob needs a lot of um, sunlight uh -huh. to build really beautiful high shield crown. Uh -huh. mm. Okay. And the Java. Yeah. And this is uh, a Blue Venus. Oh, uh. alright. Yeah, it's really nice. So, how long is the plants already? I mean, is that the platinum called Rainium? Yeah, called Rainium. I got this already six, more around one year. Okay. Uh, but from the seller, it's already quite big, lah. Yeah, yeah. I think the plants are growing really healthy there. Yeah. Here is the maybe the temperature is really should yeah, suitable yeah. for this one. Yeah. This is the really nice temperature to grow platinum because it's not really hot and also there's really breeze air wind here. Mm. Yeah. And also this uh, sunroof creating a really nice uh, filter sunlight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I think Aroy and also the platinum are really growing really well here. And this is um, Hama Lomena. Hama Lomena Stardust. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Stardust, yeah, yeah, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's really beautiful. It's not the pink color one. Uh, the pink yeah, color yeah. now is pink splash or anything. Yeah. But it's really nice, you know. So, this is also another corner for you to decorate with your right mm. ones. Uh, right, yeah, this is splendid. Yeah. This is Monstera. But most of your plants here are growing in pots, right? Yeah. I mean, in the, even in the. In even the, the, also pot in the pot. Is there any reason? Uh, easy to move over. Oh yeah, the, so you can move uh, around to decorate with your place, right? Yes. Will you take some plants to put inside your house? Sometimes we'll be rotate. Oh. Uh, maybe today I put this, uh, maybe after one week I uh, take out then put another one. So when there's a guest coming to your house, yeah, you yeah, take yeah, the plants yeah, yeah, yeah. as a decorative yeah. element, right? Yes. Yeah, yeah. It's so so nice. you don't need to fit in the same place. Uh. Yeah, yeah. But there will be a lot of work for you to move around. Uh. It's an enjoy <laughs> also. Yeah. Uh. True. It's it's <laughs> like it's like a bird standing yeah, on a yeah. log, right? Yeah. It's when you bought it, it's already become like this. Yeah. The the seller quite creative, uh. Yeah, uh, yeah. You do a really lot good. something like this. Uh. So I I can see you grow a lot of platinum also. Mm. And this, this is a really, really fancy display. Really, is it a really I think it's a it's a tin front. Yeah. Yeah. And do you have any collector's item for the platinum? I have one. Okay. Yeah. The is it here? Dwarf. Uh, not here. Another. Oh, it's another, a dwarf platinum. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Can I see? Okay. So yeah. this is ah. platinum jagger. Oh, okay. It's a dwarf platinum, and it's yeah, grow yeah. really wow. Yeah. I mean, I mean, you don't do any bonsai the adjustment. Yeah, uh, adjustment. Right? No, you just let it grow in, in a natural uh, state. Under the sunlight, quite strong. Under the sunlight, there. Yeah, it's mm. an, in, at the back of the kitchen, right? Yeah. So is this your favorite right now? Uh, can say. Okay. Yeah. yeah. It's growing few fronts. Yeah, I think yeah, the is coming out. Yeah. So I think some people when they grow this dwarf platinum, like Mr. Ju, you know, he will actually use some bonsai wire to yeah, I saw someone separate it, adjust, you know, and yeah, let, adjust let the, it. You know, it's more easy to grow. But like you say, you don't have the time to get <laughs> wild. <laughs> you let it grow wild. Yeah. That's your that's your preference to grow platinum also. Yeah, yeah, it's really good, really nice. As looking. long as it's uh, healthy, then okay. But how long do you grow this already? Uh, around four months. Four months. Uh, yeah, not bad. Four months. Mm. I can see this is the latest. Uh, I saw. I think fonts. around got four pieces the new hand. Yeah, I uh, can see that. It's really out. nice. Yeah, this is uh, all the new sh new fronts here. That's all for today. And thank you so much, Jimmy, for you know the house tour and also your amazing collections. Thanks of for coming. Boy. Yeah. Yeah, and uh, it's really eye opening so that we can be able to see how architect collectible toys and social plants can combine together with a really busy lifestyle that you have, right? Okay lah. <laughs> I think come most back of the time me. you are not here, right? You only uh, come back during the night time. Yes, like a hotel check in, check out on your <laughs> for sleep. <laughs> yeah, that's why you will enjoy your time here. Yeah, sitting your off day. Oh, yeah. during today's your off day, right? Yes. So you'll be enjoying it yes. here. Yeah. And yeah. Asking some friends come over, you know, have, have a coffee. chit-chat gathering. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, it's really nice, you know. And thank you for having us here, to be honest, you know. Eye-opening. And uh, that's all for today guys. If you really like the YouTube channel, please share with your friends and also subscribe my YouTube channel. If you want to see anything new, drop your comment in the comment box below. Bye bye. And thank you. Thank Go you. ahead. <laughs> Go really? ahead. Bye bye. <laughs>